I've suffered with severe headache for 15 good years. 15? Yes. Jehovah. There was a time it was so bad. Mm. I was very sick. Mm. I was in hospital. Yes. I was in one week. Mm. Then I was in the hospital after some hours. Tena, mm. Nikagonjeka tena ile like my dad really cried when he came to see me. Yes. Na ndio tumerudi tu kutoka hospitali. Yeah. And one thing I said mm. God mm. um because ulichukua wawili mm. I do not want to see my daughter suffer. Patipo kuanadia baba. Welcome to the music stories. I'm your girl Maggie Joy Blessings. Sina kuanga mlembo. Thank you for always watching this show, Yani. Mume kwa baraka. You guys have stuck by me since we started and we are here. Tuko show number. If you've been following my show, tell me to show number ngapi. Maybe, just maybe, you might get a gift from me. And today we have a lovely person. So today the show is very joyful because we have two joys. I will let you know how that is going to be. So stay tuned. Don't go nowhere. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Kwanza naitwa Joy Pekol, mm. nimeokoka mm. na mpenda Yesu sana mm. na ameniokoa, mm. amenifadhi. Mm. Kuna vita mingi sana Mungu amenipigania. Na ndio maana nimefika mahali hapa. Amen. First of all, thank mm. you so much Joy uh -huh. for welcoming me in this show. Oh, I don't take it for granted. Hey. So that's the, why I'm telling you guys <laughs> the show is joyful. Yeah, <laughs> because such opportunities are rare. Uh -huh. There are so many people outside there who mm. wish to come here, mm. but they haven't got this opportunity. Mm. But here I am. Ish, you're it's blessed. by the grace of ah, God. It is and I'm grace so of humbled. Thank you for honoring us when we called and you accepted to come. Yeah. So how has the journey been? Joy pekol ni nani? Mzaliwa wapi pekol ni jina ya wapi ba Wow. Mm. So many people have been asking me who mm. is this Pekoli? Mm. Jina Pekoli is Pekol. unique. Hey, see, naka, it is eh, it unique. It is unique. Yes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Mm. So Joy Pekol mm. ni mzaliwa kutoka Malaba. Malaba? Malaba. Hii Malaba ya? Boda Kenya, Uganda. Oh. That's where I come from. Uh -huh. Yeah. So me ni third born kwetu. Mm-hmm. Na nimesomea shule ingine huko mashinani na ito wa Machakus Primary School. Okay. From Malaba? Ma, Malaba. To Machakus. Ba. Sio Malaba ya Kakamega. Eh, I know. Hii ya boda ya Kenya mm. na Uganda. Uganda ya. Yeah. Huko. To Machakus. Ya. Yeah. Uh -huh. Mi ni mteso. Oh. Eh. Eh, Watezo wanasalimia nangaji? Leo tunakanya <laughs> shuwa na kiteso. Abakiro. 
a vaquero. Unasema a joker. A joker. Eh, eh, eh. Yeah, I had a pastor. <laughs> you really. Yeah. I had a pastor who, who was a teso. Okay. Eh. Yeah. That's where I come from. Mm -hmm. And many well, teso wanaimba vizuri hivi. <laughs> there is a friend of mine anaitwa Etienne. Uh -huh. Najua nitamtumia hiyo naambia yeye. Kumbe wateso mnaimba? Yeah, wateso tuko, mm -hmm. tunaimba ni vile tu hatujajulikana. Mm -hmm. Lakini tuko, Lakini Mungu anatusaidia. Tun, tumeanza kuimba kiteso sasa. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ya. Kwa uko na wimbo mmoja ya kiteso. E, niko nayo mm. do iko studio. Mm -hmm. So nangojea kutoa. You're working on it. Yeah, working Kitoka on it. tafadhali make sure umeleta hapa. I will. My fans wajue wateso wanaimba. Kabisa. Mm -hmm. How are the journey been? Yeah. Ah uh, nimelelewa kwa familia ambayo inapenda Mungu. Mm. Um, both my mom na my dad mm. ni watu ambao walikuwa namjua Mungu hata hivyo bado wako ndani ya Kristo. Nice. Na nimependa sana vile walitulea mm. kwa sababu tulikuwa tunapelekwa Sunday school by force by, by fire. force by fire. Mm. Alafu ni wale wazazi walikuwa wanapenda kuimba. Kwa hiyo walikuwa natuambia walikutana kwa kikundi cha sifa hapo ndo walijuliana ndo. Yeah, we are. Hey, so wewe ni mtoto wa wana mziki. Yes. So we kuanza kuimba iko kwa kazi ngumu cause mama alikuwa anatufunza sana mm. kuimba kuna nyimbo zile mama yako amekuandikia ama ya yeah, kuna zile nyimbo mama mwenyewe alikuwa anatuandikia mm. kwanza dadi yake kuja jioni nyumbani mm. mm. ana lazima sisi watoto tuende tumwimbie e, kuna oh, time tu saa zingine eh lazima so ah. saa zingine tukienda kuimbia dadi anakuwa like nimechoka <laughs> tokeni hapa <laughs> nini <laughs> and it was so good mm. and sometimes anakuwa so much excited mm. na tu hapo tu ndo tukaanza mm. You know. Wow. Mm. So safari yako ya mziki like kwanza ku record mm. ulianza lini? Um vile tu nimesema mm. nimeishi kwa familia ambayo watu napenda kuimba, yes. penda Mungu. Mm. So nimelelewa nikiwa najua at least kuimba yeah. hiyo kwaya the basics. Eh, mm. basics tu. Mm. Nikienda high school mm. sikuwa so much into kwaya because mm. I was so naive. Mm. Nilikuwa naogopa sana. Mm. But now when I came to university mm. nimesomea KCA university mm. um mpenzi mtazamaji tuko na university kwetu <laughs> <laughs> yeah Eish. so kitu ili trigger kabisa nianze kuimba mm. ni situation nilikuwa nayo mm -hmm. um i've suffered with severe headache for 15 good years 15 yes jehova So hiyo condition ilikuwa mbaya sana. Mm. Vile nimesema mimi ni third born, mm. tulikuwa five of us, mm. then two died. Mm. Uh, and then so it reached a point pia karibu ni niage. Cuz oh. hiyo kuwa on and off uko hospitali, uko shule, mm. unaitwa cuz mm. nimegonjeka sana kumwa na kichwa. Mm. But mpaka wa leo mm. hakujai semekana ati nilikuwa mgonjwa nini. Mm. Daktari wako ipata. Mm, mm. Cuz anytime nikienda hosi wananiambia niko mgonjwa typhoid ama yeah. malaria mm. vitu kama hizo. Mm. So I suffered for 15 good years yes. and uh, it was really traumatizing even to my parents. Mm. I remember there was a time my dad mm. sijuka anaweza kumbuka mm. nimekuwa nikitaka nisishare that thing mm. because i don't know how he'll feel maybe akisikia hivi mm. there was a time it was so bad mm. i was very sick mm. nimepelekwa hospitali yes. nimekaa uko one week mm. then kurudishwa nyumbani mm. after some hours tena mm. nikagonjeka tena ile like my dad really cried when he came to see me yes. na ndio tumerudi tu kutoka hospitali yeah. and one thing he said mm. god Mm. Um because ulichukua wawili mm. I do not want to see my daughter suffering. Mm. Maybe kama like just remove this pain maybe mm. pia hata huyu pia mchukue eh, it's like cause, he gave up. Yeah like oh. anaona mtoto wake ni mgonjwa it's so it feels painful mm. sindio mm. kwa mzazi kuona mtoto wake akisafa. Yeah. But I think mm. at that point my God had the prayer of my dad. Mm. Because I feel when he reached at his end mm. he came Yo, through I felt good at some time mm. point nikaanza ku feel niko sawa mm. so when I joined campus in mm. 2011 yes. and now 2012 nilikuwa bado nasumbuka 2012 mm. nikagonjeka sana mm. sana sana mm. until the school management took me to St John's Gidurai mm. wakati ni when I was unconscious mm. I remember I stayed there from 8 in the morning yes. back at 6:30 in the evening. Mm. 
Mm. Um, when now I gained my conscience, yeah. there's this verse God gave me mm. in Philippians chapter 4 and verse 6. Yeah. And he said, do not be anxious of anything, mm. but in everything through prayer, supplication, and thanksgiving, mm -hmm. let your request be known unto me. Mm. You know, when I was in that state, no, no, joy, I was unconscious. unconscious. Yes. So he gave me a song mm. through that verse. Mm. Because when, when I was still unconscious, mm. I saw grave, mm. Nini Sanduku, mm. and my mom was there, and mm. at, it's like, at nilikuwa ni mekufa, so my mom is crying, and like, he's telling God, please, mm. umechukua wale wengine, don't take, take this, this one, one too. Mm. So, hapo ndo nikajua, and God gave me that verse, and mm. gave me a tune of a song. How does it go? Eh? I would like to hear the song. Mungu wewe ni mwema wewe ni mwaminifu unafanya mambo yapitayo fahamu zetu ndio maana Mungu nakuita mponyaji that song mm. iko kwa ICD yangu wow. the first uh, album i did yeah. in 2016 mm -hmm. When you ukiona, mm. iko inaitwa umwema ah. kwangu. Though sikuweka hizi songs si YouTube. Ah, kwa nini? It's a story on its own. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we we'll talk about it. <laughs> yeah, so from that place, mm. I told God, because mm. I amenipatia mean, another chance to yes, live. Yes. Nikambia Mungu, mm. I will sing for you. Yes. I will sing for you. Amen. That's why I came up with the song, Yesu wangu na kupenda. Yeah, you just have to love him. Yes, I'll just have to love him. Mm. And he gave me, I, I can you know, a big congregation, mm. like I'm the one singing, mm. and now the congregation is there. Mm. So I felt this is a calling. Wow. And that's where I, after, after Nimepona, mm. I wrote some songs, mm. which they are in this album. This is your first album. First album. So dear to you. So dear to me, ndo mana mm. wanatambia na ACD sana. Kwa mm. zina ni kumbusha vitu mingi. Every song here is, has its own it's testimony. Own story. Yes. One of these fine days we will call you. You come and just share with us like the whole month. We have chapter one, what? two, yeah. three. But <laughs> yes. Yeah. And then how was it going to studio maybe? Mm. Who supported you during that particular time? Um, when I wrote those songs, mm. sikuwa job, mm. I was still in school. Mm. But uh, me and you let say mm. hardworking. Yes. Like, napenda kusema hivyo because mm. I'm a strong woman. I'm yeah. very hardworking. Mm. I like outgoing. Mm. So nikiwa shule bado nilikuwa natafuta tafuta to jobs. Yes. There's a job I got walikuwa na nilipa 5000. Yes. Pale Lovington. Mm. Na nasoma KCA. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Imagine. Mm. So I used to work during the day mm. then I, uh, during the night mm. love I go to work during the day. Mm. So wakati nilipata hizo tu pesa tudogo tudogo mm. nilikuwa nakimbia studio mm. nalipa 1000 mm. which producer did you work with for the first time uh, alikuwa anaitwa Jose mm. Jose Jose alikuwa na studio wapi uko umoja ah. yeah, umoja mm -hmm. alafu alikutulikuwa na church moja so aliona niko na hiyo passion yeah. i have a passion mm -hmm. i can sing mm -hmm. so akaniambia jo you need to record these songs mm -hmm. so akaenda aenda alinisaidia sana which year was that 2016 ah you started singing in 2016 yes Whoa. and how has the reception been with your music when i started it wasn't good mm. because one mm. still bado nilikuwa naive mm. alafu ukiwa mgeni kwa industry watu ni kama like uwezi kuwa acceptive haraka sana mm. so nilikuwa napenda tu alafu again i wasn't exposed si kwa mm. najua kuna youtube mm. si kwa najua vitu more about music yes. So mi nilikuwa tu wacha niende studio, mm. niimbe, nitoe mm. CD, ni uzie watu. Oh, so me that's what I knew. Sikuwa najua vitu mob. Mm. And then I, I got at a point, nikakuwa so much discouraged. Mm. What happened? Because uh, I was going through a lot of stuff. Mm. What was it? Your stuff? <laughs> eh? Kukosa pesa, mm. ilifika place, my dad yalikosa a job. Mm. So life ika kuwa ngumu tu sana, mm. then supporting myself also mm. here in Nairobi. Mm. Ika kuwa so 
tough mm. unajua tough times za yeah. youth yeah. Eh, yeah. wakianza life hapo hivyo mm. umemaliza shule mm. then you expect to get a job, a job and then, then job by patikani mm. so nilikuwa napitia vitu mingi mm. that's why sikuweza kuendelea na Lamsi. music mm. yeah and when you told your parents now you want to sing mm. what was their reaction um my daddy and mommy have been supporting me so much because mm. they know that is what I love doing mm. even when I cook mm. when I'm in the bathroom mm. everywhere wewe well, umefanya so, zote bathroom record kila kitu mm. like so they know hata nikifika home mm. they'll just know watakuwa nasikia sauti so, yangu anywhere mm. like watajua tu hiyo ni joy so mm. they have been supporting me awajakuwa na hiyo joy and then my mom is like my prophet ah. yeah cause yeye hu, hu ninenea sana mm. Mm cause there's a time alikuwa ananiambia oh vile unapenda kuimba hivi mm. one day utakuwa unaongea kwa tv like tutakuwa tunakuona kwa tv uh, so i feel my mom prophesied for me like it is come yeah. to pass and it has come to pass like mm. you see we are here hey, we are taking a <laughs> short break hapo kwa prophet ndio tumekwamia we'll be right back Karibu sana kwenye Music Stories. Asante sana kwa kuendelea kutazama kipindi hichi. Yaliojiri wiki hii. Katika pita pita zangu niliweza kuona spa ya watoto inaitwa Prini Spa pale Lovington. Watoto wanafunzwa pale neno la Mungu. Watoto walimu pale wameweza ku, kuona hata watoto wana kipaji cha mziki na wanaweza ku, kuwakuza na kuwasaidia. Ukiwa na muda uka, unaweza ukapeleka watoto pale, wakafunzwa, wakafunzwa kuimba, wakafunzwa kucheza hata keyboard na katika music stories hatuongelelei tu mziki peke yake ila hata talanta. So ukiwa na, na ukiwa na muda peleka mtoto wako pale, akaweze kufunzwa na kunyolewa kija nyumbani amefurahi, anajua kuimba, anajua kusoma neno na neno la Mungu litaendelea na watoto wetu watakuwa wakimjua huyu Yesu. Tuendelee kwa ku, ku, ku watoto wetu waweze kupenda Mungu na waweze kupenda nyimbo na waweze tuweze kukuza hivi vipaji ndio tusiwapoteze watoto wetu in future. Asante sana kwa kuendelea kutazama Music Stories. Kama uko na mahali unafunza watoto chochote, niongeleshe nitumie message katika YouTube, katika uh, Instagram, Facebook nitaweza kuja mahali ulipo. Bora tu unafanya kitu cha kumtukuza Mungu. Asante kwa kutazama Wema TV. Welcome back viewers. We are here with Joy. So I told you guys today the show is joyful because we have Joy Pekol and Maggie Joy Blessings mm -hmm. and we are all smiling 24/7. And she is a lovely person to hang out with. Thank you. She has a beautiful voice and a beautiful story. Thank you. Hey, you are a true definition of a miracle. It's a blessing wow. from God. Uh -huh. yeah. And then your mom yeah, prophesied my mom, and then it's happening. It You're is. Here. It is You've happening. You've been to several TV stations. I've been to several TV stations as like a dream come true. Yes. And any time I go there I tell mm. my mom you mm. remember you said this. Oh, and you and always and remember. Kwanza there was a time akaniambia na bado oh. zitakuja ku ku So I'm not giving up any soon mm -mm. because I know mm. whatever God whatever a, any parent mm. acts speak a blessing to a child yes. it comes to pass and the best thing that your mom ever did is to introduce you to Jesus yes and she's praying for you she is and do you have a mentor musically um <laughs> <laughs> i have Who? i have one mm. is called david kefa ah yeah he, he also sings yeah he sings mm. but as yet i'm a produce music music zake mm. but he's a good trainer uh -huh. and um he 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 knows mm. how to to kupanga music ah. yeah so i compose the songs mm. then now we go sit down with him mm. and then tunaipatia the song uh, the beat that inaitajika uh -huh. then so he helps me and guides sana ah yeah. david kefa is doing a very good he job is. because your music are very uh, well arranged Amen. So leo hii mm -hmm. hapa Kenya ukiulizwa nani ungefanya naye collab apart from mimi? Yes, swali unauliza No, tuanze kwa nani ukubariki hapa Kenya? Eh, okay, Kenya is blessed. Yeah, we are blessed. Kenya is blessed mm. and we have good good gospel artists mm. yes, in Kenya. Yes. Um I love Evelyn Wanjiro's music. Mm -hmm. I love Sarah K. Yes. I love there's so many musicians mm. I love. Yeah. We have Babette there. Oh. Like they bless me so much. Mm. We have this lady um there are so many and um if God I mm. always say mm. that uh, God I can put a chance ya kufanya na musician wa Kenya. Mm. Mimi 
nitakuwa blessed mm. so sita samati ati huyu ako hivi ama yeah. akoaje but yeah. mwenye god ata, ata nipatia chance ah. ku kuimba na yeye yeah. mimi yeah. niko na multiple choices i know you have an answer for my question uh-huh. kipewa uh-huh. uimbe na eh, ringtone apoko uh-huh. ama garden angel eh oh my god <laughs> ama 2020 aki mbona unanifinya kwa kona <laughs> <laughs> well, no, it's kwa just kwa... a question. So yeah. in... <laughs> I'll sing with Guardian Angel. Jima na kwanza I know <laughs> he's my brother he watches this show so Jima. Eh, uje ufanye ile kit that could let you you pass. Yeah, so, like, okay, okay, you can connect the end it has killed. Guardian Angel. Ah, yeah. Guardian. Fanya venye ufanye. Fanya venye ufanye South Africa. So, so you would you would work with Guardian Angel comfortably. Yes, very. Why? because mm. um i feel his songs he, mm. he, he, he ministers to me so much mm. and uh, again mm. um like his songs you can sing in church mm. and la alafu ajakuwa na hizo clouds mob sana kwa social media vitu mm. kama hizo so mm. then he's so much consistent ah. like every song yenye anatoa mm. it speak it's all just speaks about god mm. it's it, we can relate with it in our daily lives mm. yeah there was a time they said gospel music in kenya is dead mm. what can you say about that it depends with someone who feels it mm. and uh, where unojuki labda hao wenye wako huko ndani sana unaje mimi sijaingia huko ndani sana labda hao wenye wanajijua wenyewe mbona umejitoa kwa hii story wanajijua wenyewe that's why maybe wanasema hivyo but i pray that because uh, i have started that god me because he created me to be a worshiper i want to worship him we want to be unique and whatever music that we produce mm. mean, may minister to the lives of many people mm. so i'm not even there to concentrate on who failed mm-hmm. who did what Hallelujah. where did they why did they do that mm-hmm. i want to concentrate on myself and tell god mm. to create in me that mm. clean heart yes. even when i go outside there mm. i minister and i may become a true worshiper wow. that is my daily prayer nice yeah and do you have maybe uh, can you go if a pastor needs you to go and minister mm. Can you go? Uh, one, mm. um, I have a principal yes. because I minister and uh, I have a church that I go. Yes. Um, you feel free to tell us your church. Who's your go? Yeah, I go to Overcomers Hope Ministries mm-hmm. under Pastor Joseph Mnene and mm. Sue. Aha. Stuck it same hashtag because ninyi wote mtajua. Eh. Si pole. So uh, I have a principal because I also minister in church. Yes. I'm a present worship leader yes. there. Mm. So lazima niongee na my pastor. Ah. Yeah, lazima niongee na my pastor and release. Kama it is possible for mm. me to go that Sunday, mm. I'll go or any other day mm. because lazima niongee na yani bless peer. Ako release na yeah. blessing. So yeah. what can you tell this waimbaji wale wanaimba na they don't have a church that they belong to? Uh, they need a spiritual covering. Yes. Yeah, they need a spiritual covering mm. so that they can ad- identify themselves because if you don't have a direction mm. then uh, you might fail at one point or mm. the other. Mm. So I would feel mm. that they will need someone to direct them to tell them mm. no mm. or yes. Mm. They'll need someone to speak to mm. and direct them. Mm. Yeah. There is this uh, there've been an issue mm. whereby you find a believer they are engaged Mm-hmm. and then they are staying together what can you say about that and is it a good thing oh like uh, we are talking about a relationship now yes a relationship but uh-huh. wanaishi yes between a girl and a lady yes. oh, God. okay yes. it's okay mm-hmm. um oh God. <laughs> <laughs> help someone the, the bible is clear yes. that um because two and two people come together mm. it's like they are married yes Yeah and if you're not married then you should not come together mm. because definitely you're going to sin mm. or rather let's say you're going to fornicate mm. yeah so i would uh, advise maybe th- the people who are dating mm. to wait on god's time mm. to or rather to plan themselves mm. well mm. so that they can get married together because mm. god blesses 
a, a union. Mm. God blesses marriages. Mm. There's a blessing when two people come together. Amen. But if they aren't and they are staying together and there's no that blessing. Very true. Yeah, there's no that blessing. And mm. you know the enemy mm. will just use the two of them at our Danganya too mm. so they can fall into temptations. And you know, mm. temptations in Guinea what on a semati I was tempted. Mm. God tempted me. No, it's mm. not God who tempted you. Ah. You brought the temptation to the two of you to yourself. Ah, yes. Kuna, kuna wale walisema mm. kwa watu wameokoka wawili ni kama saa ni mbili safi. Mm. Haziwezi pakana uchafu. Hapana, mm. na si kwa nini <laughs> ah, dhambi inafanywa na watu pia ambao <laughs> wameokoka. Unaona? Mm. So we we don't need to deceive ourselves. Yes. The Bible said, let's know the truth, mm. and the truth shall set us free. Amen. There's this truth that they don't know, mm. that when they come together, they are not married, they are going to sin. Mm. So they are, they are ignorant about it. Very so true. we should not take the word of God for granted. Mm. And kuna scriptures what one is a quote to just to justify, to justify themselves. Mm. Unona, so that wa, wasionekane kwa dhambi. Mm. But no, the Bible is truth. Let mm. us walk in the truth. Amen. Yeah. And you said you had an issue with the headache and all that. Right now as we speak, it disappeared. Yes? It is. It disappeared mm. because when I rem that day mm. when I gained my conscience, yes. I have just quoted a verse mm. in Philippians 4, 6. Mm. God promised me that I will not die, mm. but I will live. And from there, arakama kicho ineza nigonga kidogo, sio ile. Maybe ni mekosa kunyo maji, you know, if it come a hizo. Ama usipo kunyo chai. Ama usipo kunyo chai. Hizo ni vitu very normal. Yes. Yeah, lakini chai, please make sure you take. I'll show you a cup that I use. Very nice cup. So, do you have other projects coming up? Do you have people you're supporting, like you're mentoring? You're mentoring? Yeah, I have some projects. Can I share something small? Yes, yes, yes. Um... There's something God did to me in yes. 2019. Yes. It's just in line to my music when now, no, th this album, mm. I did it in 2016. Mm. And now, nika na challenges, mm. nika chana na yo. Yes. Then 2019, mm. nika anza project ingine. Mm. This is what happened. We had traveled to our rural home mm. in Kakamega. I am married by the way. Oh, wow. Sorry. Ndugu kama ulikuwa pale, umeanza kuriba saika. He's married. I'm married mm. uh, to one man, mm -hmm. and uh, we are blessed with two children. Uh -huh. <laughs> Tell uh, us about three it. Three and two. Wow. Yeah. Mm. So, I'll be like, I'm going to say, Mom, I'm going to talk to you. Well, you say, Monday, Tuesday, story, to normal use. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. Congratulations. Thank you. So, um, we had, it was on August mm. 7th. Mm. We had traveled to a rural home in Kakamega. Mm. Now, when we were coming back to Nairobi, yeah. We got an accident mm -hmm. along Gilgil to Naivasha. Mm. It was terrible that because was. it was my husband was driving. Mm. Then I was there, my house girl, mm. the baby, mm. and our cousin. Yes. Then I was pregnant. Mm. So we got our vehicle, I uh, lost control. Mm. Then Ika, Ika, Ika roll. Ika. It rolled three times. Then wakati lianguka, mm. ilitoka kwa barabari, kanguka, Ika face on the side like tulikuwa tunatoka. And the worst thing ililalia on my side. Oh, no. So I didn't know kama tuneza toka tukiwa wazima mm -hmm. in that car. Jesus. And um, I always say that God saved me he did. from accident, from he that. Because mm -hmm. I just closed, I remember I closed my eyes and I told God, please mm -hmm. take over. Take over. Then I waited for the next land. Mm -hmm. The next land, kufungua macho, like I now felt... Oh, niko bado mzima like mm. gari imesha simama yeah. ndi tukwa zima. Then I heard the cry of my baby. Yeah. Then when I looked on this side, my husband is still alive. And I told God, you mean we are still alive? Wow. Yes, blood was oozing yeah. out of yeah. me. But it was coming out. Mm. I don't know from where because I don't even feel any pain. Jesus. Though blood in a talker too. Mm. But I felt, wow, we are still alive. Mm. However much, what one of us said to take a yo gari, mm. but we are alive, yes. all of us. Mm. Now people came to pick my tea. Oh, yeah, from his or rolling on the Jotu bus. 
Because uh, even the state of the vehicle, the car, car, it was written off. Yes, it was. Jesus. So when they came, found mm. us when we are still alive, mm. they didn't even believe. There's a they woman who told ghost. me, mm. "Woman, I want to serve the God you are serving." Oh. And I felt, "Wow, there is a God in heaven." Jesus. So we were rushed to Naivasha level mm. four mm. hospital. Mm. Yeah. At night. Mm. Then I put the feel pains in my body. Don't come Then And now there's this song that came. Mm. Like it was I was telling God, God, mm. you're my healer, you have yes. saved me from mm. this accident. Mm. You're the only one who can do what no man can do. Mm. And that's when the song mm. Only you, Jesus mm. came. Hey, we will sing that only you, Jesus Kidogo to skin. <laughs> Savior Hila. Everlasting God, the one who changes not. Mighty warrior, doing marvelous things. Only you can do what no man can do. It is that whenever I sing that song, mm. I, I feel the presence of God. Oh, like, it really takes me back. Yeah. And uh, I usually ask myself, huh. actually, if it, it was not God, God, who would have saved me? Mm. Meaning there is a God in heaven. Yeah. Even when you're going through deep pain, yes. even when you're frustrated, mm. disappointed, when mm. you're heartbroken, yes. when someone in your family has died, mm. you're down. Mm. For sure, there is a God. Yes, He's a way maker. Amen. Yeah, He yeah. made a way in the desert. Like Akasema, okay, I know you people are going to die, but mm. watch and watch. Because I, I relate with people who mm. who get accidents. Yes, Kadogo too. Somebody is is gone. Very but true. we were there. Nangalianga your gari, and I'm like, I'm still alive. Then joy, let me serve God. Let us serve the Lord. Wacha niimbie tu. Wacha tuimbie tu. Hata kama naimba vele si watu wengine wanaimba kusikie goosebumps. Hivyo tu vele God amenibariki. Wacha tu niimbie Mungu. Wow, umesema uko na projects mpya? Niko na working on certain projects. I have two songs, four songs in my record. They are still in the studio. Yes. And I'm asking God to bless me with more money. Money. We need yeah, to. Because those are, that's one of the challenges two musicians mm. go through. Because there's somebody somewhere mm. who can sing, yeah, who has true. songs, but they that don't is. have finances. Because mm. it is very much expensive mm. to produce music. Amen. We are trusting God mm. that to keep up our pesa, mm. maybe bali, bali. Bali. Yeah, but to we are trusting the process. Mm. The thing is here, mm. we are trusting the, the process, process and God is writing a report for us. Eish, what do I you think, tell people? I think Maliza na iyo. Eh. Maliza na, we are what? Trusting what? The process. Eish, ile kizungu ni megongwa na msichana wa kiteso hapa <laughs> leyo. Eh? Ebu, kuna msani maybe mahali ya megiva hapa. Mm. Anataka kuacha kuimba. Kuna mama mali maybe ni mugonjwa, mm. you know, going through something. Talk to them. Matthew eleven twenty eight mm. says, mm. "Come you all." Mm. God, it is Jesus Himself who is speaking to us. Yes. Johni, inu wote. Mwenye mumeleme wa na mizigo. Sometimes sisi mizigo ni zadani ni guni yomekewa hapa. Ni mizigo ya kukosa pesa. Yes. Mizigo ya familia. Very true. There's pains, mm. school fees, mm. music, yako in a, in a chini, the projects are there. Mm. Like you don't have hopes again. Because mm. there's time I also felt that. Mm. But you see what? Jesus is telling us, mm. come all, even sinners. True. Not only that, the ones who can pray in tongues mm -mm. only. Mm -mm. Come all, mm. yani he has included everybody. And Atal just come Shabab. as you are. Mm. Atal Shababa kisema, come all, yepia kikuja kwa Jesus. Mm. Come with your burdens, mm. I will give you rest. Amen. So God is there to mm. give us rest. Mm. He has assured us yes. that he will give us rest. Because mm. his yoke is easy. Mzigo wake ni mwepesi na nira yake ni mwepesi bado. Unasikia? So don't give up. Because if there is hope for a tree mm. that has been cut, cut off, 
then what about you? He's still alive. You're still alive. If there is, the, and I say, better, you know, a lion, Velik, mm. ikikuja all of us will be normal. To make sure. But there is hope mm. for a living dog. Kama, there is hope for a living dog. Mm. What about you can walk? Mm. So keep your faith alive. Amen. Unona, mm. keep your faith alive and mm. trust in the Lord. Amen. At his own appointed time, God makes things beautiful. Yes. Yonia. Twitter, wale muna tweet, tafadhali, eka yu hashtag. So, tuma salamu nyumbani, alafu when the projects are ready, please, feel free to come and share with us. Yeah. And we will call you again and again. I feel we need to have you here for like three <laughs> months, non-stop, so that we get the whole story. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, natuma salamu kwa my dad mm -hmm. and mom, mm -hmm. Dixon Mrade Pekol, mm -hmm. mom Florence. You mean a lot to me. Mm -hmm. Thank you for believing in me, mm -hmm. raising me up, and just kunishikilia mkono mama and dad mm -hmm. i celebrate you and to my salamu ko my dear husband mm -hmm. thank you for always supporting me mm -hmm. and praying for me mm -hmm. and he believes in me wow and he always tells me that you are greatness you are you you are a star uh -huh. that will always bright mm -hmm. will be brightened yes. always like ananiambia kwanza yeye ananiambia ga trust the process mm. wow Usilia. Mm. And my children, mm. Leti and Azania, I love hey. my kids, hey. my brothers and sisters, mm. Pastor Obed, mm. Nakupenda, pamoja mm. na your wife, mm. and David Kefa, mm. usini achilie, mm. adela kunishikilia mkono, mm. mungu wakubariki sana, Amen. my pastors, mm. the, my churchmates, mm. and my fans, hey. oh, oh. thank you for supporting me so much, because mm. mnanitia moya, ata mm. mkiniandikia message kwa messenger, mm. like, you're just there when I release music, you're telling me, Joe, you're going far. Mm -hmm. It means a lot to me. Mm -hmm. And everyone, everybody who is supporting me, mm -hmm. I celebrate you so much. Siezi kata kusema my mentor, Pastor Ibrahim Kwendo, wow. and your wife, Joy Kwendo. Mm -hmm. Ile kichapo muna ni chapanga, <laughs> sasa gini ni kikosea. <laughs> Aki mungu wa bariki sana. Amen. And thank you for directing me. And yeah. Facebook, Twitter? Facebook, na itwa Joy Pickle. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. YouTube Joy, mm. Pekol, mm. Twitter, Twitter, mm. <laughs> Twitter, Twitter, Twitter. 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 Joy Pekol, mm. Instagram Joy Pekol. Mm. Yeah. Ah. Mm. So wakikutaka wakupate pale, maybe oh, you don't give out your number. If a pastor wants you to go minister, they can just inbox you. See yeah, they can say. get me, inbox me, mm. what I need. Yes. Thank you so much for coming, mm. and you are a blessing. I have enjoyed. Just staying here with you. Joy. Thank you. It is a joyful day. <laughs> and guys, thank you for watching the music story. We appreciate your feedback. I pray that God will always bless you by when you watch such testimonies, you don't have a reason to give up. You don't have a reason to go back. Keep serving God. Hold on. Hang in there. It doesn't matter how it looks today, but tomorrow it's surely going to be bright. Leo maybe when imgonjwa kesho, Uponyaji unakuja mungu wetu ni uponyaji. Thank you. This is Nagi Joy Blessings on Wema TV. God bless.